Welcome to my YouTube channel. Before I go into today's video, let me say a very big thank you to those that are subscribed to my channel. I do appreciate your support. Thank you. I also appreciate my returning viewers and if you are new here, please click the subscribe button down there and hit the notification bell so that you'll be informed whenever I upload new videos. Please like and share this video so as to encourage me and support my channel. If now support your boy, it will be cool. Now let's go into today's video guys. White Money fans have started reacting to his Instagram account that was taken down as they say that it was as a result of the account being reported. White Money fans have reacted after BB Ninja Season 6 housemate White Money's Instagram account with almost 700,000 followers was taken down a few hours ago. Prior to, uh, to the account being taken down, White Money had 699,000 followers, making him the most followed male housemate in the house. Meanwhile, a backup account has been opened for his fans to follow until the main account is restored. Sharing the news on his backup page, his social media handlers noted that they are working assiduously to bring the account back. Reacting to this, an unconfirmed accusation from White Money's fans is that Perez fans were responsible. They mentioned that they planned this on their, social, on their WhatsApp groups to bring White Money down. No evidence yet to substantiate this as at the time of making this video. These are some of the fans' reactions. Ikeagu Mashi said, and I quote, Will this one stop me from voting my Mazi? Never ever. Kati Dili Mari, Marians Akiki said, and I quote, He will still win regardless. Okonko Fego said, and I quote, Nawao, but it will not stop us from voting for him. End of quote. Obviously, it is a case of account being reported, but the question begging for answer is that who could those people be? Or which housemates could they be supporting? In another news, Liquor Rose, White Money, Nini, and Cross win UID Challenge. The remaining 11 housemates in the Big Brother Nigeria Season 6 Shine Your Heights House had a challenge in the house yesterday that was sponsored by UID. The challenge was in three phases. One of it was done individually while the other two was done as teams. The, the teams are Team Password, which has Sasuke, Angel, and Yusef. Team Security, which has Pere, Emmanuel, Saga, and Coin. Team Identity, which has White Money, Liquoros, Cross, and Nini. The first phase of the challenge is for the housemates to be verified by UID they were called one after the other to stand in front of the TV, perform some action, and then wait to be verified by UID. The second phase is a quiz in which the teams get to pick random questions from a board. Each team had three rounds of six questions to answer, making the total questions to answer for each group 18. The third part is a short TV commercial to advertise the UID brand. After all the challenges, Team Password was the second runner-up, Team Security was the first runner-up, Team Identity was the winner of the challenge and for their win, they were rewarded with 1 million naira. Congratulations to White Money, The Quarrows, Cross and Nini. The Quarrows has told Emmanuel that she's, she needs some space and as such Emmanuel can mingle with, another, with other housemates. BB Niger housemate Liko Rose has asked Emmanuel to give her some space as she wants to have some time alone. Liko Rose made this discussion with Emmanuel while they were talking in the garden after her diary session. This new attitude towards Emmanuel comes a few moments after Biggie tasked Liko Rose to, have, to avoid him until her next diary session. If, you, if viewers will recall, during Liko Rose, Diary session with Biggie yesterday, she was charged to avoid and pick a fight with Emmanuel until her next diary session. She was not supposed to disclose any of this information to him. In an attempt, attempt to execute this plan, she told Emmanuel that what I am trying to say is that I don't want you around me. I would want you to mingle with other housemates. In another news, after Licoros has told Emmanuel to give her some space, the unhappy fans of Emmanuel have started reacting to the task that Biggie gave to Licoros as it is already affecting Emmanuel. Big Brother has yet again come, with, come up with another set secret prank task and this time it is for the lovers in the house. He shagged the Coros to ignore Emmanuel till our next diary session. The reason behind this prank is, however, unknown, but it is believed to spice things up in the house. The Coros has already started acting the script out as she has already told Emmanuel to give her some space. 
However, Emmanuel Swans and fans of their ship are not happy about the pranks as they believe it might take a toll on Emmanuel who already feels bad about evictions and is also being told he's boring. Emmanuel, who is up for eviction this week, cried during his diary session yesterday as he seems to believe he might go home because he's not doing much in the house such since Ebuka told him on Sunday that he has been born. Fans believe this is the time he needs Likoros the most so that he can have someone to talk to and someone to comfort and encourage him in, his, in this hard time. Many of his fans have therefore taken to social media to react to the prank and are unhappy about it. As Desuwa tweet and I quote, I hate it when Emmanuel looks sad, piggy, this too much for my boy. This is E time is neat. The Quarrows, HBB Niger, at Emma Mie, AJ, tweet and I quote, Though it's tough seeing you like you are now, wish you knew it's a prank. Prank, you are strong, we got your back, Papa Emily. At CCRE 15, tweet and I quote, She can drop a note in his bag with style or on his side of bed, HBB Niger. At saying underscore Jane, tweet and I quote, Emmanuel is silent, I wonder what's going through his mind. HBB Ninja at Uma Umwami Kazi tweet and I quote Sure is not aware yet. Reality will set on him in the next three to four hours by the time the Coros move to the red room. Please vote for Emmanuel O HBB Ninja Ash Imaros. At Miss Damien tweet and I quote What is Biggie's intention about this prank? To entertain us. Unfortunately, we are not having it at all. Rubbish prank. I hate it. HBB Ninja. At knockwork underscore uh, mapri tweet and I quote. This is unfair. Ima cried today and now this. He needs all the support na right now, especially this week. And Biggie comes with this prank. I don't want another KV situation. Mental health is very important. One needs sanity in the midst of this world game. HBB Ninja. Fans have started reacting as Saga fails to execute Biggie's task of avoiding any. There was a new twist in the BB Niger house this week as Big Brother has charged Saga to avoid and pick a quarrel with his love interest, Nini, until the next diary session. According to Biggie, Saga should start a fight with Nini without letting her notice that it is a prank. This special task was given to him during his diary session on Tuesday, September 14. Biggie promised to reward Saga some amount of Abeg Naira if he can successfully execute the plan. Biggie said, and I quote, Saga, Big Brother would like you to start a fight and avoid Nini until your next diary session. A few moments after this conversation with Biggie, Saga was seen massaging Nini's feet. Fans believe Saga is obsessed with Nini and he cannot execute the plan. In another news, S. House Smith, Sammy names Yusef and Sasuke among his top five finalists. SBB Niger season 6 housemate Sammy has named housemates he believes will make it to the finals of the reality show. Sammy made this prediction during an interview after he was asked to mention which five of his former housemates thinks will be finalists. Though he initially said he doesn't want to mention names as this show can be unpredictable, he however shared that he has not he has not he had noticed the chorus white money and angel have lots of fans so he believed they will make it and added Sasuke and Yusuf to his list. He was also asked which housemate he believes had a strategy and explained their strategy and he named Pere Boma and White Money. Sasuke and Yusuf are up for a vision this week and many seem to believe they might be evicted come Sunday as their competitors are top contenders. The two are up for a vision together with Angel Cross and Emmanuel. Let me know what you think about this in the comment section. Before I go, let me say a very big thank you once again to those that have subscribed to my channel. I do appreciate your support. Thank you. If you would like to watch more of the fun in the Big Brother Niger house, kindly click the subscribe button down there and turn on the notification bell so that you'll be informed whenever I make another video. Also, please like this video so as to support this channel and also help me share to people so that they can also enjoy the fun in the Big Brother Niger house.